Heading back to the boxes now for the last semi-final of the launching pad. Trooper T is the favourite at 2.25. Hector Fawley at 3.80. Al Zenity at 3.90. Out now out to four dollars. Trooper Tears, second to Medio Manelli last week from box six, goes to box eight. It's won five of ten with five second placings. 29 and 29, the best over this distance. Hector Fawley was a super winner in 29 and 40 from box seven, goes to the yellow tonight. It's won seven of 16, best time is 29, 25, won four of nine over this trip. Al Zenity ran second to Victor Alvey in 29.58, draws draws better tonight, drew the five last week, into two tonight, won two of six, best time is 29 and 27 over this distance, had two goes for a win in a second, they're the top three, Cracker Jack Rob's next best at $10, has won six of 14, third last week to Zara Mani, $16, uh, $12 for Blazing Dodge, who was third to Victor Alvey, $16 for Kenya Exceed, who won in 29 and 46. And long odds for the other pair. Getting set. The last two spots for the launching pad. Just about set to go. Green light is on. Semi-final number four. Ready to go. Set and away. Beginning quickly on the outside was Trooper Tears is going to sail over and the favourite leads from Blazing Dodge through to second. Up to third was If You Say. Al Zenity gets into the fight now up to third. Behind them was Kenya Exceed from Cracker Jack Rob. Well off the speed was Hector Forley and Livet. But the leader was Trooper Tears. Out by four. Trying hard was Blazing Dodge. Al Zenity's trying to get up on its inside. Clear then of Kenya Exceed. But Trooper, Trooper Tears wins it by seven. Al Zenity gets through to the fight. Final ahead of Blazing Dodge in third. Fourth across the line was a photo between Kenya Exceed, if you say, and Hector Fawley, and it could go either way. Clear then of Livet and Cracker Jack Rob, and the time is out of this world 28 and 99. Hasn't that thrown a spat? He's broken 29, and Trooper Tears has made a huge impact ahead of next week's launching pad final, Pete. Do you think he could break 29? No, I didn't. I thought he could get down to about 29 too, the way the dogs have been racing tonight. But to see that's just amazing. Clearly, what the draw would have been a concern coming in, but he's overcome that easily. No, he likes it out wide. He's not a mad crasher. He gets that clean run early, and he's got that. He's de developing some nice early pace. It must be uh, good for the team as well. I mean, they showed so much pr promise so early on in their career, and now they're through to one of the biggest races there is for emerging greyhounds that must be must be a relief from that point of view too oh absolutely i mean it's a great series for the young up and coming greyhounds he's like he's won six or seven now and really he's run second every other start so the quality is there it's going to be a hard final because there's all good dogs that get through quality gets through to group races so we'll see what we draw and hope for the best in the final and he's one of the best of them pete so good luck thank you very much Peter Riley there obviously handler for, handler for the britain camp and trooper tears has gone whack Time's been amended to 29.01, so he hasn't exactly broken 29, but boy, oh boy, near enough from it. So there's four semi-finals of the launching pad behind us. Box draw coming up upstairs following race number nine. Two, one and seven on the last leg of the quaddy. Eight, two, one and seven, the numbers. Trooper Tears first was the favourite. Well supported on the fixed odds. Pays $2.80 and a dollar the place. Second, Victor Alby, 250, make no promise, 210. Fourth in, number eight, Osprey. Fourth in was, it's got number eight, Osprey Athena. That's not right. The board says seven. I'm just going to fix uh, this app up. I think it's, no, it's gone back to the previous race. So we'll have to stand by for those dividends. Here we go. Trooper Tears, 230, $1.04. Al Zenley, $1.30. Blazing Dodge, 240. If you say no, 